Put it in my truck and now the end It's time to get it back Driving across America in a big white golf attack I got the big truck ready in the AC blowing ice Golfing in the city and driving through the night sometimes cooler today so I'm hoping for a better round I mean not that the last round was bad Little Rock was a fun place so. last night there were all kinds of storms actually this morning if you will so it's cooled the area down Made it a lot more pleasant to golf today. It's supposed to get up later, like the temperature is supposed to get up, but at least for now, we still have the coolness. So I'm gonna try and get this round in and get on the road, and I'll tell you all about it. I'm gonna be in the pro shop next. All right, so I'm at the Wichita Airport, right? R right, basically right across the street at, at uh, what's the what, Tex Combs? Tex Consolver Golf Course? Tex Consolver Golf Course. It's a beautiful day, rained, rained really hard last night, lightning and thunder, but it looks like the course is in great condition. Um, just uh, nor normal normal rules, cart on the path today. Cart's on path because of the rain, had about an inch this morning and an inch yesterday morning, so it's pretty saturated out there. Nice. Uh, what are the normal green fees? Uh, green fees to walk is 25, to ride is 37.50 per person. Nice, and is that on weekends as well? Uh, weekends is two dollars higher. Two dollars higher. Yep. And do you have any senior discounts? Uh, we don't unless uh, they purchase the senior membership. Awesome. So uh, I got a couple minutes before my tea time. I'm gonna go chip in and putt. All right, I'm on the first tee. I just had a great drive. I'm with a couple old timers that seem. I'm sorry, freaking awesome. My bad. Uh, one of them owns a snow removal company and he's got a pirate flag with a snowman on it. I'm gonna try and get one of them flags because you all know me. <laughs> all right, so check this out, we're out here. And apparently I just, these guys were nice enough to let me go on the course with them, but I was starting on hole, what was it, six? Six. Yeah. I started on the six. Got the pro shop and says, go the, that twosome. I see these two guys yeah. show up to them. I go, hey, yeah. I guess I'm with you. And they're like, great. Yeah. Five holes later I realized. <laughs> but it's a great day out here it's still still cool enough to, to not die having a great time daryl and rich here yep. rich, rich owns uh what what is it wichita snow wichita removal dot com yeah he's he's check out that that and uh shirt there yeah uh, daryl's my secretary yeah <laughs> team double d <laughs> enjoy gonna, it tom i'm gonna get one of those flags with that snowman on there because it's gonna be great so anyway, we're on 15 now. Uh, somehow I got to talk the pro shop into letting me get back on one to get the uh -oh. first five holes. <laughs> All right, so I'm back on one, which I, well, I'm on one now, having played uh, six through 18. So hopefully, I can get the same as I was doing on the six through nine because it was freaking amazing. And then after I realized I was on the wrong hole, so hopefully it'll be better this time. All right, so I'm on to got a double bogey the first hole. Just gotta relax a little. Like I, I think that's mainly what's going on. I did really great because I wasn't swinging hard the, those first couple holes. I just kind of you know going through it and. Um, then after I realized I was out of order, I, got a, I don't know, a little whatever, and had a horrible back nine. But um, still having fun, because it's golf, and it's freaking gorgeous out, and there's a nice breeze, which is keeping me kind of cool. Got the family tees over there, you see the family back there. It's 
so uh, hopefully they'll let me play through after this hole and we'll try and catch up to them quick and uh, see what happens. And uh, fingers crossed that I can still break 90. Alright, well, end of the round. It was a beautiful day. Had a lot of fun and I gotta keep remembering that because even though I parred, uh, let's see, after one, two, three, four, five holes, I was one under par. I still only shot a 91. Um, so a little disappointed with myself about that, but you know, still a long way to go to Reno. So I imagine one of these courses, I'm gonna go ahead and break that 90 bark. So anyway, here's my scorecard. And uh, we're here at the truck. So I'm just gonna say, have a, have a great time and uh, I hope you all enjoying this so far. <laughs> Take care. Hey guys, I'm in uh, Heston, Kansas. Kansas, Heston, H-E-S-S-T-O-N, Heston, Kansas. And I just wanted to shout out to Lincoln Kirk. Lincoln Perk. <laughs> it's like like friends meets alternative rock. Freaking awesome. I gotta work on my swearing. Um, so on the road, getting to Denver today, I believe. And uh, yeah, see you soon. <laughs> just uh, arrived in Denver, Colorado. I am at the Saddle, Rack, Saddle Rock Golf Course. It's three in the morning-ish. Um, so I'm gonna try and get around. You can't book a tee time online apparently right now. This is the city of Aurora Golf Course. And uh, I'm gonna see if I can't get around in. But I'm also going to go ahead and stay in the parking lot. <laughs> Because I, I I feel like you know I feel I feel like we're gonna be able to get get around in uh, I'm gonna give, be able to get around in so I'm all set up back here and uh, I got the hammock ready I'm going to sleep for like two hours and. Um, Hopefully we'll get a game of golf here. If not, we'll find somewhere else in Colorado. We'll see how bitter they get with me. Hopefully uh, there's no cops coming. <laughs> um, all the reviews say it's a great place. A little pricey, but great. So I'm excited. Fingers crossed. <laughs>